Hi guys, this is Dr. Rajeshwar from YR PharmaTube. In the previous video, we learnt the ring analogues of phenothiazines. If you did not watch the video, hit the i button on top right of this video to watch it. To watch the other topics of medicinal chemistry, click on the links given right below this video. In this lesson, we shall discuss the fluorobutyrophenones such as haloperidol, droperidol and risperidone. A number of different compounds of the piperidine and piperazine series with parafluorobutyrophenone group substitutions at the nitrogen atom display significant neuroleptic activity, for example, haloperidol, trifluperidol, droperidol, etc. There is a considerable interest in butyrophenone derivatives as antipsychotic agents as well as in anesthesiology. They exhibit pharmacological effects and a mechanism of action very similar to that of phenothiazines and thiothixines in that they block dopaminergic receptors. However, they are more selective with respect to D2 receptors. The general structure and structure activity relationship are expressed in the structure shown here. Attachment of a tertiary amino group to the fourth carbon atom of the butyrophenone skeleton is essential for neuroleptic activity. Lengthening, shortening or branching of the 3 carbon propyl chain decreases neuroleptic potency. The aliphatic amino nitrogen is required and highest activity is seen when it is incorporated into a cyclic form such as piperidine or piperazine. A parafluoro substituent increases activity. The carbonyl group gives optimal activity although other groups such as CHOH and CH-aryl also gives good activity. The Y group can vary and assist activity and an example is the hydroxyl group of haloperidol. The empirical structure activity relationship suggests that the 4-aryl piperidino moiety is superimposable on the 2-phenyl ethyl amino moiety of dopamine and accordingly could promote affinity for D2 and D3 receptors. The long N-alkyl substituent could help promote receptor affinity and produce receptor antagonism activity and or inverse agonism. Some members of the class are D2 and D3 receptor antagonists and are extremely potent antipsychotic agents. Extrapyramidal symptoms are extremely marked in some members of this class which may be because of a potent dopamine block in the striatum and almost no compensatory striatal anticholinergic block. Most of the compounds do not have the structural features associated with effective anticholinergic activity. Moving on to the individual fluorobutyrophenones, we begin with haloperidol. Haloperidol was discovered in 1958 by Paul Janssen. It is a high potency traditional first generation antipsychotic drug and one of the most commonly used antipsychotic medications used worldwide. It is classified as a butyrophenone possessing a fluorine atom. Its IUPAC name is 4-4-4-chlorophenyl-4-hydroxypiperidinyl-1-4-fluorophenyl-butane-1-ohn. It is a phenylbutylpiperidine derivative with antipsychotic, neuroleptic and antiemetic activities. Haloperidol is synthesized by the alkylation of 4-4-chlorophenyl-4-hydroxypiperidine using 4-chloro-4-fluorobutyrophenone. 4-4-chlorophenyl-4-hydroxypiperidine is synthesized from 2-4-chlorophenyl-propene which on reaction with formaldehyde and ammonium chloride gives the intermediate 4-methyl-4-4-chlorophenyl-1,3-oxazine, a reaction known as Prince reaction. Treatment of the resulting product with hydrochloric acid leads to the formation of 4-4-chlorophenyl-1,2,3,6-tetrahydropiperidine probably through a stage of opening of the hydrogenated 1,3-oxazine ring followed by dehydration and subsequent recyclization. Addition of hydrogen bromide to the double bond of 4-4-chlorophenyl-1,2,3,6-tetrahydropiperidine and the subsequent alkaline hydrolysis of the 4-4-chlorophenyl-4-bromopiperidine 
formed during the reaction gives 4 4-chlorophenyl 4-hydroxypiperidine the reaction of which with 4-chloro 4-fluorobutyrophenone which is obtained by the reaction between fluorobenzene and 4-chlorobutanoyl chloride gives the desired product that is haloperidol. Haloperidol is a white to faintly yellowish amorphous or microcrystalline powder. It is practically insoluble in water and is stored in tightly closed light resistant containers. Haloperidol competitively blocks postsynaptic dopamine D2 receptors in the mesolimbic system of the brain thereby eliminating dopamine neurotransmission and leading to anti-delusionary and anti-hallucinogenic effects. Antagonistic activity mediated through dopamine D2 receptors in the chemoreceptive trigger zone accounts for its anti-emetic activity. Haloperidol is sold under the brand name Haldol. It is a typical antipsychotic medication used in the treatment of schizophrenia, tics in Tourette syndrome, mania in bipolar disorder, delirium, agitation, acute psychosis and hallucinations from alcohol withdrawal. It may be used by mouth or injection into a muzzle of a vein. It works within 30 to 60 minutes, thus it is a long-acting antipsychotic drug. The next drug is Droperidol. Droperidol was discovered in 1961. It is a butyrophenone with anti-emetic, sedative and anti-anxiety properties. Its IUPAC name is 3144-fluorophenyl. 4 oxobutyl 3 6 dihydropyridine 4 il benzimidazole 2 own. It is a haloperidol in which the hydroxyl group has been eliminated with the introduction of a double bond in the piperidine ring and the 4 chlorophenyl group has been replaced by a benzimidazole 2 own 1 il group. It is a member of benzimidazoles, an organofluorine compound, and an aromatic ketone. It has a role as a first generation antipsychotic drug, an antiemetic, a dopaminergic antagonist, and an anesthesia adjuvant. Droperidol is synthesized from 1 benzyl 3 carbethoxypiperidine 4 ON, which is reacted with orthophenylene diamine, forms 1 5 benzodiazepine. This 1 5 benzodiazepine on reduction rearranges into 1 1 benzyl. 1-2-3-6-tetrahydro-4-piperidinyl-2-benzimidazolone. Debenzylation of the resulting product with hydrogen over a palladium catalyst into 1-1-2-3-6-tetrahydro-4-piridyl-2-benzimidazolone. Subsequent alkylation of this product using 4-chloro-4-fluorobutyrophenone yields the desired product droperidol. Droperidol is a solid white to light tan amorphous or microcrystalline powder. It is odorless, tasteless and is hygroscopic which has a melting point between 145 to 146 degrees centigrade. It is sensitive to light, air and heat. When heated to decomposition, it emits very toxic fumes of fluoride and oxides of nitrogen. Droperidol is a dopamine D2 receptor antagonist with some histamine and serotonin antagonist activity. It is primarily used as an antipsychotic drug. It has a central antiemetic action and effectively prevents nausea and vomiting in surgical and diagnostic procedures. And the last drug of this lesson is Risperidone. Study of Risperidone began in the late 1980s and it was approved for sale in the US in 1993. It is an atypical benzoxazole derivative with antipsychotic activity. Its IUPAC name is 3246-fluoro-1-2-benzoxazole-3-il-piperidine-1-il-ethyl-2-methyl-6789-tetrahydropyridopyrimidine-4-on. It belongs to a class of pyridopyrimidines that is 2-methyl-6789-tetrahydropyridopyrimidine-4 on carrying an additional 2-4-6-fluoro-1-2-benzoxazole-3-il-piperidine-1-il-ethyl group at position 2. It is a member of pyridopyridines, an organofluorine compound, a heteroaryl piperidine and a member of 1-2-benzoxazoles. It has a role as a second generation antipsychotic, a dopaminergic, serotonergic, an alpha adrenergic, a histamine receptor antagonist, and a psychotropic drug.
Risperidone is synthesized by Friedel Crafts acylation of difluorobenzene with piperidine 4 carbonyl chloride gives a ketone compound. This ketone reacts with hydroxylamine to form an oxime which cyclizes in the presence of a base to form 6 fluoro 3 4 piperidinyl benzoisoxazole. N alkylation of piperidinyl nitrogen yields risperidone. Risperidone is a solid white to slightly beaky powder which has melting point at 170 degrees centigrade. It is soluble in methyl chloride, sparingly soluble in alcohol, practically insoluble in water. Its mechanism of action is not entirely clear but is believed to be related to its action as a dopamine and a serotonin antagonist. Risperidone is sold under the brand name Risperidol. It is widely used in the treatment of mania and schizophrenia. It is also used to treat bipolar disorder and irritability associated with autism. It is taken either by mouth or by injection. This is the list of references followed for the lesson. That's all in this video, the fluorobutyrophenones. In the next lesson, we will discuss about beta amino ketones and benzamides. Till then, never stop learning and never stop watching my videos. Thank you for watching this video.